Hey guys, welcome back. Episode 5 of Hostile Survival. This is Bearded. Um, I've been busy. Um, in between episodes, um, I decided to do some grind work and uh, get some things done in between. Um, as you might have seen on the intro there. Um, so, yeah. Let me give you a little show around and um, do what you think. So most of the wreckage is gone. You see, we just have a big hole. Um, and that is mostly thanks to uh, Bob over here, who has got some armor plating. Um, so I worked on him. Um, he actually performs quite well. Can't quite take a full cargo load full, but he does okay. Um, it's a lot better than hand grinding or using the old uh, grinding crane. That grinding crane was a disaster. Um, anyhow, he's up here charging up. Um, once he gets a little more charge in him, we are going to jump back in and probably finish up just kind of grinding the rest of this, which is mostly steel. Um, the other thing I wanted to mention too is we did, or I did, add a, another mod. Um, I don't know if this was a smart thing for me to do, but... Um, I thought I would make it a little more challenging and I added the aw scrap mod. I'll leave a link in the description down below um, It's a pretty good mod um, pretty well known, but basically when I grind things down um, It turns into scrap and I only get a portion of the um, Resources back so that makes it difficult, but it also presents some good challenges in that I can find hostels and we'll have to use some engineering to um, maybe detach blocks that I might not have the resources for, or it would just be easier to do it that way. So that's gonna be fun. So you can see, I have a very full container. Um, the large container is not quite full. It's nice, it's got, I got a lot of room there, but most of it is scrap, a lot of scrap. So um, I was running the basic refinery for it to kind of turn that into ingots, but I'm running into a power issue. So we'll go to our to-do list and that's our main thing today. I want to get some more power, um, probably in the form of wind, wind turbines. Um, I think that'll be my first and foremost um, thing to do. Then I can finish grinding up the wreckage and then we can start working on the base. Well, that's my hope for today. I've been very fortunate. I've been really good about keeping antennas off. Not really putting a lot of broadcasts out there. Um, I don't know if there's anything. Oh, nope, there is. There's an Obin tide out there. He's moving away. Anyways, um, I'm thinking I might actually punish myself a little more and add another hostile uh, NPC mod. To this game um if i decide to do that it might be next episode or we'll just see i kind of wanted to give myself a chance to uh get things a little settled here on caldera um and see what we can do um but yeah i think we're progressing quite well i think what i'll do is i'll put use this pillar here where my lights are at and Make that more of a wind turbine. A wind, a windmill, basically. Um, so yeah, let me see where we're at. I wanna see where I'm at with um, old Bob here. I think I hit his batteries. Fully we'll recharged in four minutes. Good, that's awesome. Um, I might try and actually place some of the blocks from the cockpit. I have never done that before. I know that's a feature. So let's see if we can get this done. Go we'll grab some steel plates, I think. I am gonna turn the refinery on. Let's see if we can hold with power. Now that he's pretty much, Bob's pretty much charged up. We'll see how it goes. I don't hear it going. Oh, see? 
not enough power here. I bet you it's because Bob's on recharge. So what we'll do... Have a landing gear. Oh, must have lost my landing gear. Oh, well. Good enough. Now we're cooking. Turbine or turbine? Wind turbine. We need a wind turbine. This is very different. Um, so to go back, I think I do, yep, control G, like if I don't want that, that's handy. That's the easy part, I guess. Now the hard part is welding that up. I just want to make sure that the auto lock is off. Okay. So, um, computers. I think it's just computers. So we will just grab. all of those computers and we we'll stick them in here. That was really easy. I mean, for the most part. Big question is, if I go into a battery, 
Here's the one on the base. Recharged. Nice. So for now, we know we're okay with this. I like it. Bob, you are doing a stellar job. I just want to say. Um, we are going to turn you back into your good old grinder self. All right, Bob, we are going to grind down the rest of this stuff and then lay out a base. Well, we've been here before. Dang it. Okay. We were doing good. <sighs> uh, another grinder. hoping to get done before the sunset. What do we have left? Um, maybe I'll do that by hand. Let Bob charge up a little bit. I have another battery down there. This one I found it was full, which is awesome. Add that to the base and then there is another one down there. Like way down there. That hopefully I can dig out. So. Let's give this a shot. I think I can get this. Easy.
Oh yeah. Gotcha. I gotcha. Just don't hit anything on the way out. And we have two batteries to put on the way. Woohoo! This would be nice. This would be good. Good power problems. Solved for now. Saver. Thank you so much. I think he's turning out to be a good little addition. Okay. Uh, this would be kind of like a stage two for this power issue. We've got five wind turbines up. That's our one that we started with. Good thing. Um, which gives us a power surplus. Yes, we are recharging. It's just remaining nice and full. This is awesome. All the scrap is gone. At least to the best of my knowledge. We'll find out when the sun comes back up because it's dark. Um, it should be a while. I think it's time for that script. So let's see if I can build a programmable block and we'll see if we can't get Izzy's inventory manager running. Um, help us organize some of this stuff. So I think maybe second cargo container, programmable block, and we'll see what we can do after that. Let's go with that. I hope I have enough. I have 43 grids. We'll see. We can put production down there. We have a little landing pad here, maybe another one over here. That'd be kind of our main area. We'll do some server room. We'll do, we need production. We'll see. I kind of have an idea in my head, but I'm not sure. So, let's go with that. Um, let's stick you over here. Hydrogen bottle, four. Metal grid, 500. Okay, so that's Izzy's inventory manager. We got him set up, we got some good numbers for our start here. Um, yeah, this should help out a lot. So, I'm going to go upstairs and get some oxygen. I think what we'll do next is figure out where to put these batteries and start laying the base out. Okay.
Come on. Oh wait, I need both. D. I need a weld pad here. What was I thinking? Yeah, let's um, do that. And we'll stick one there. Okay, attempt number two. I think we're all right with that. Sweet. That's nice. I like that. Two parked up. Cool. I am happy with that. So. I think while I'm waiting for the sun to come up, we can weld up just this down here. Because what I want to do, you know, is I kind of want to follow the contour a little. I'll probably still drill some of this out in here, but for now, I'm going to just kind of floor this off um, just to give it some area to work with. Because I still am forming ideas in my head as far as, whoops, what I want to do. Do. Till the sun comes up, let's do some welding. Okay, how are we doing? Oh, come on. The sun's got to be close. It's so dark. Wow. Oh, what do I see? I think the sun is finally making it up over the horizon. So... Yeah. Let's see how this goes. Let's do some laying this out and we'll see how we feel.
I think I'm getting some idea as far as what I want to do, so yeah. This will be another landing pad. Kind of sunk in like this side, which I like. We'll make some adjustments there, add some lighting. May add well, we'll see how this goes. But this is potentially an entrance here. This will all get moved. Um Yeah, and this will be kind of a control area. And then down here we'll we'll see how it goes. Okay. Well, I didn't get as far as I wanted to today. Um, I think we've got a, mm, an okay start on the base here. I think I have, I kind of like the idea of having a couple landing pads here or docking areas, whatever you want to call them. Um, there'll be a connector in the middle there. We'll have Bob over there, of course. Um, we did get some stuff done there today. That That's a good thing. So let's look at our to-do list. Um, we ground down the wreckage. That's a big win. Um, we got more power. That's a good win there. Um, I'm going to say we kind of are still working on laying out the base. Um, we're going to need to start to focus on some defenses in it sometime soon. Because I know the bigger I get, the more um, aware the hostile NPCs are going to be. Um, so we're going to be careful with that. Anyways, the awe scrap is going to be another thing that's going to be a challenge, but I think that's a good thing. Um, it'll kind of help me think about what I'm doing and not just be able to grind down and know I just get my components back. So um, I have diminishing returns. So yeah, yeah. Next time I think we'll um, work, keep working on the base. Um, I think it might be a good idea, whoops, wrong buttons, to maybe come up with a scout ship. Um, kind of survey the area, get out and about, and see uh, what's out there. I guess let's add to production facilities, um, that'll help out too. Full, full size refinery, full size assembler. Um, yeah. We'll just kind of leave it there for that. That'll be a good start to do it. Um, anyways, hope you enjoyed. Um, I had kind of some fun. Bob's a good ship. I'll get him posted on the workshop. Um, let me know what you think about that. If you like what you see, subscribe. Let me know. What you think I should be doing next, what I should focus on, uh, what your thoughts are for the base, and maybe some ideas of how to lay it out and what to do with that. But uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. It's, uh, I think it's been a good episode. It's been quiet. I'm a little concerned, but we'll see. <laughs> I'll catch you next time, guys. Uh, have a good one.